Welcome, YouTube, to the Cincinnati Explosions. Uh, this is week five. This is really hype. This battle, it's going to be really tough. I feel like I could, uh, like, this battle is not going to be so tough exactly. Like, I can easily play this well and easily win this. But I feel like if I make one big misplay, I will basically insta-lose. Because we indeed are up against... <sighs> we're up against... Uh, hyper offense. So that's not great. Or the closest that you get with hyper offense based on how people have drafted uh, this season. So, um, yes, I'm going to go over some threats So on their team. So first, Landorus is a big threat. Hyper offense, wall breaker, just very OP, just great and amazing in general. Halucha, which is pretty strong and is a threat, but not quite a threat until you take into the fact that it, they also have Tapu Bulu, which alone is a threat, but makes Halucha an insane threat and can easily sweep through teams. Um, basically a lot of uh, my whole teams has uh, Celestila resting on their shoulders. Because without Celestila, um, then they sweep through my team. So this is what I mean by misplays, and I need to make sure that my Celestila does not get a lot of uh, chip or damage or whatnot. Um, okay, so... Uh, Megalopony is huge. It's such a huge threat. It's actually insane that they drafted it round four. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. But in any case, um, this is a threat. Jellicent is actually really good for walling my team, and that's an issue. Rebombi, I don't think that they're going to be bring Rebombi, but that would be bad. But who knows? We'll see. Um, yeah, that could be good tech, but it's basically bad against my whole team, so I don't know. Rotom Frost. I haven't really prepared for Rotom Frost because I don't really think it's coming, but you never know. Can't be too sure. Dragalge, that's a huge threat, and it's also really strong, and it's just amazing all overall. Um, yeah, Dragalge. Oh, dear. Um, yeah, it hits everything really hard, and it's, um, yeah. <sighs> it hits through things. It tanks stuff that's offensive and then kills me with stuff that's not offensive and then stuff that's defensive on my team i deal a hit to it and then it hits me for like even more damage or whatever yeah in any case <sighs> it's stressful but it's also cool age of slash age of slash i'm worried about um if they can set up on me and if i'm in a bad position already they could easily sweep me with it so i'll have to be careful with that <sighs> Embor, I don't think that they're going to bring Embor. Lunatone, I don't think that they're going to bring Lunatone. Because, you know, Embor isn't really good against my team. And Lunatone isn't really good at all. It's only good in key situations. And I don't think that this is one of them. <sighs> Alright, so that's my opponent's team. Now let's go over my team. So to start things off, we have Friend Chunk. The normal Friend Chunk. That we've all grown to love. Uh, running Chlorophyll. Because you always run Chlorophyll just in case because it can come into play every so often gotta be careful uh synthesis leech seed gig drain sludge bomb kind of a standard ish set i'm not actually running sleep powder which could turn out to be a mistake but i couldn't really find um smooth slots for it without making myself like basically a sitting duck with for free setup in front of some mons i don't want that so um i'm running almost max HP, or max HP, almost max defense, and I'm running eight, eight, eight speed EVs, which may seem weird, but I do this a lot, actually, with um, my uh, slow mons, because if a mon is trying to just barely speed creep a slow mon, and they're slow, and they would normally be running minimum speed, but they're instead trying to outspeed my mon, then I run eight, so then I still outspeed them, and basically they've wasted a bunch of their EVs, whereas I've only had to use uh, one additional point. Uh, we got Rick Astley, uh, the Rick roll, as he goes rolling and spinning, 
Oh, and it looks like we got the challenge already. Whoo, here it comes. But I'm going to finish going over my team. Uh, dang it, I messed up my EVs. Um, heck. Alright, we're going max defense on this. Uh, on this puppy. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, left leftovers for the recovery. Sturdy, because it's the only valid uh, ability. Stealth Rock, because everyone wants Stealth Rocks. Ice Shard, um, it actually hits a lot of stuff for super effective, and it should deal massive amounts of damage to Landorus to it KO. Rapid Spin, just in case they bring, they have a chance to set up rocks or something, because I'm not, I'm not carrying, uh, boots on Jack. Uh, high horsepower to hit, I don't remember what, but to hit some stuff, like, whatever. I'm not carrying Earthquake, because they have grassy terrain. Uh, yeah. Blueberry Child. That's the Latios, Life Orb, Levitate, Ice Beam, Psychic, Shadow Ball, basically hits everything for super effective, and Roost for extra recovery. I am running uh, Speed to Outspeed uh, Landorus. Yeah, this is basically my Revenge Killer, and I think that it's going to be actually really strong here. Um, going to eat your face. This is my lead. I'm leading Slurpuff, almost guaranteed. Unless weird stuff. In any case, it is a suicide lead. Uh, Focus Sash. Unburden, Sticky Web, Endeavor, Protect, Flamethrower, Protect, because they have Mega Log Funny, and I don't want them to be able to fake out me. Um, Endeavor, because it's Endeavor, Sticky Webs, because it's Sticky Webs, and then Flamethrower, in case they go into Age of Slash, and then they decide not to go for Shadow Sneak, and they decide, or they decide, like, I don't know, just in case, this does about, like, 50%, if they're not... If they're in shield form, it does like maybe 50%. If they're not in shield form, it KOs. Uh, I'm running minimum defenses, minimum everything. You know what? Let's make this max attack possible for the lulls. Uh, yeah, he's going to eat your face. And I'm going to set up. I'm going to take down him on and going to win the game for me. Jack the Pumpkin King. Uh, left reverse because that recovery late game. Like, you've seen, like, I'm sure that you've seen past battles that have used him. Um, leftovers is key. Uh, it's been, like, getting that extra recovery would be so powerful. Imagine against Glyscore. Oh my god. Okay, Pyroball, Zen Headbutt, you turn Taunt. Taunt is for Jellicent. Uh, the first time I'm going to go into Venusaur, and then the second time I'm going to Taunt it, so I've conditioned them that they're planning that I'm going to go into Venusaur, so they won't scald me. Anywho, you turn because it's U-turn, and it's good to just have pivot and stuff. Uh, Pyroball hits everything, basically, except for, like, Jellicent and a couple stuff. And uh, Zen Headbutt hits Dragalgy, which uh, Pyroball does not hit. Also, EV to outspeed Landorus. Um, <sighs> Dr. Doof, Leftovers, Beast Boost, Heavy Slam, Leech Seed, Flamethrower. And then Protect just for that extra recovery, because it's I think it's going to come in key. Pretty standard set. Anywho, that is all. And I'll be back with the battle. Okay, so I'm back and I'm ready to battle. Uh, I'm really nervous and I'm afraid that the battle might take too long because I'm really nervous and I'm going to be taking a long time. But hopefully it's okay and this video doesn't run too long. Whew, here we go. Oh my god, what? They bring Embor? Oh no. I'm having flashbacks again. They don't bring Low Funny. They don't bring Low Funny. Oh my god. And what? What are they doing? Wh okay, well, Embor, that's unexpected. Embor is very unexpected. And that is. That stresses me. The fact that they brought him on. Which I wasn't at all expecting. Um. Now the question is. Wow, I don't think that I actually want to lead Slurpuff anymore. Wow, okay, this caught me totally off guard. Oh my god, are you kidding me? It's whack. Hmm. Okay. Because Sticky Webs doesn't really do much. Mm. Okay, well, they don't bring... They bring Halucha... But they don't bring Bulu. 
and none of their mons are really fast enough that I care a lot about outspeeding them. Actually, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so now this puts me in a bit of a. This is an issue now. This is gonna lead Slurpuff. But now, none of their moms really care about webs. And I'm afraid that it's just gonna set up on me. So I kind of would rather have Dawnfan in here and go for rocks. Because rocks are looking really strong here. But on the other hand, that could lead to the same thing. I'm going to lead. I'm just going to go with what I've planned. Oh. Jellicent? Hmm. What does Jellicent get? That's stressful. Jellicent. Why is it? Why are they leading Jellicent? I don't understand. I guess to taunt me, probably. Trick Room. Oh, Trick Room. Jellicent gets Trick Room. What if they're going for Trick Room sweeps? Oh, that would be bad. Mm. Okay, well, this is weird. What would I swap to right now? They might be going for Trick Room, they might just taunt. Which probably makes the most sense. So, do I scout out to protect? But on the other hand, what do they do? So, Trick Room is the main thing that I'm worried about. And other stuff, they could also sub. Could also go for sub. They're probably gonna taunt. I feel like I wanna just protect and scout out what they're doing. What do they- they're just gonna hit me with some damage? I'm so confused. Like, I honestly just don't understand. Hmm. If they're gonna scald me, so maybe they're just faking me out. I think I just go into Venus War because it basically tanks everything. It could possibly do. Goes for scald. Please don't get the burn. It's gonna burn me. Oh, it didn't burn. It's a miracle! It didn't burn! <gasps> oh my god! Okay. So if they think I'm gonna Giga Drain, they're gonna go into probably Embor. Probably Embor. And if I Leech Seed, is that better or worse or what? I'm gonna be faster anyway. So I think, and they can't do anything to me really. I'm gonna Leech Seed here, because then if they stay in and they go for Taunt, I Leech Seed, then they Taunt me, because I'm certainly faster. If they go to Dragalgy. What? I guess that makes sense. What are they going to hit me with, though? Just a meteor? Drop a Draco! <sighs> so I could go into Dr. Doof. That's probably the safe play. And I'm going to make the safe play. Because I'm a safe person. Flip turn. Interesting. Interesting. I'm really not sure what their game plan is. Okay, this is their game plan. Basically, KO Steela with Ambor. And then sweep with anything else. But I'm not gonna let them do that. They do get- it does get bulk up. Um. Mm. This thing is scary. Do I just go into Blueberry Child? Come now, child. Hmm. It's a dilemma. I could protect. Just to scout out. You know what? I think let's do a little bit of damage calcs. Just to be safer. Um, I'm so surprised that they brought it. Really? They brought Embor. Okay. Okay, well, whatever. Go for this. Flare Blitz chaos me. I can't let them do that. The question is, are they going to go for bulk up? And if they are, am I going to regret going for protect? I'm just going to go for protect. 
please don't bulk up. They don't bulk up, so that's good. Hmm. Okay, so I probably... If I go into Latius, I'm going into Latius. Flare Blitz. Oh, that is damage that I do not want to have to deal with. But I probably am going to have to deal with anyway. Thing is probably banned, but, um... Latios. Oh. Oh. Flare Blitz. This is banned. Okay. Oh, this thing gets reckless? Ooh. It only did 41, though. 46. Heck. So, it's not banned? Because if it's not banned, it is not banned. Does it get anything to hit me? Um, I hope it doesn't get something to hit Latios. That would make this really scary, and that would be... They, it gets Sucker Punch. Uh, so I'm just gonna roost. Okay, they go into Aegislash. Okay, the thing is, they're not expecting Shadow Ball on Latios. Probably not, at least. So if I go Aegislash, let's say Bleed or whatever. Shadow Ball KOs me. Um, heck. Dang it, age doing damage calcs against Aegislash, like, oh, it sucks so much. Um, uh, Shadow Sneak. Shadow Sneak. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. And what else does it have access to? Um, it is... Aegis Slash, which gets, it gets Shadow Ball or whatever, gets Pursuit, it could easily be going for Pursuit right now, gets Shadow Claw, gets Shadow Ball, it gets Shadow Sneak, sneaky sneaky, sneak sneak sneaky sneaky, so sneaky, and then, uh, okay. <sighs> but let's say Aegis Slash Shield or whatever. Shadow Ball does not care. I don't probably I probably don't want to stay in here. But what if they go for pursuit? So I'm going to switching out Aegis Slash Blade. Ugh. I mean, like, Shadow Claw would kill me. Shadow Sneak would kill me. How much would Pursuit do? This is so rough! Oh my god. Okay, that does a lot of damage. I can't afford to take that Pursuit. <sighs> but I can't afford to let this thing die. Oh my god. If they go for Pursuit, and I switch, I kind of lose. If I go for Shadow Ball, and they don't go for Pursuit, and they don't go for Shadow Sneak, I also kind of lose. <laughs> so it's not a- it's not a win-win scenario at all, in the slightest. <sighs> pursuit is so good. Oh man, it's so good against Latios. I've been playing on U- on Natex UU. What do I have? What's my plan for this thing, anyway? Like, what was my plan originally? Or they might just be going for uh, Swords Dance, which would be really bad. What Does it get anything to hit Celesteela? Get stuff to hit it for neutral. <sighs> Please don't go for Pursuit. For if you do, I will be in deep duty. <sighs> my life has flashed before my eyes and it's going for substitute. Frick, I could have predicted that easy. No, I'm carrying flamethrower for this exact scenario. Bruh. 
No, no. Oh, dear. Shadow Ball, 32. I don't care about your stupid whatever. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go for Flamethrower again. Right? Because they're going to go for Sub, probably. No, they're just going to go for King Shield. Pfft, whatever. Yeah, that does 31 or so. I'm going to go for Flamethrower. Again. Dr. Doof, Flamethrower, again. Real quick. Jelly. I am jelly. Oh, I'm so jelly. Jelly, jelly, jelly. Okay, well, I got... Ah, damn it. Leftovers suck. What is Jelly gonna do? I could just protect, just to scout out. Probably gonna taunt, to be honest. But I am... Am I faster? Dang it. Heck. <laughs> I'm not Dr. Doof. Well, Jelly Scent is 156. Neutral. So I am slower because of the speed. Dang it! Because <sighs> I'm minus speed. Um, so I probably just go for Protect here. Because it's safe and it scouts out. Why? It's <laughs> this isn't very useful of it. Like, this thing is like... Sitting here clicking Scald. Just hoping for burns, I guess? Like, bruh. I don't know what, like, I don't know. Uh, I could protect here, which is probably the better play, but kind of not, because they're probably going to switch here, considering I can't really, yeah. So, if they're going to switch, what would they switch to? I don't know what they would switch to. They could switch to many number of things, but probably. It's Embor. I'm going to click Leech Seed again. There we go. Take it. I will take it. Okay. Landorus. What am I doing? Heck. What does it even have to hit it? It has Focus Blast. That thing is scary. Um, basically just Focus Blast, and if they're physical... Then what do they have? Then they can hit me with the knockoff, which isn't ideal. Uh, let's go... Steela... Uh, Landorus... Ula Wallbreaker... Whatever... It's not carrying HP, I so carry maybe... Um... I don't know, heckin... Um... Um... Maybe like Focus Blast or something. Focus. Damn it. Focus Blast. Ugh. Ugh. And how much does Heavy Slam do? Heavy Slam does a lot, too. Did I... Okay, I'm gonna protect here to get that extra chip. Although they might switch. But now, basically, I'm just getting a bunch of chip spread around on everything, which is pretty good. From Eladius to just come in and basically sweep. Until that Aegislash is out of the way, though. When that Aegislash is out of the way, I think I probably win. Um, okay, well. It's just such a... The issue is... This is gonna be such a long game. Like, it's turn 15. Probably only already, like, 15... Dang it! I, re I was really hoping that I had my custom avatar in time for this battle. I made a custom avatar, and you'll probably see it in the next video, but apparently it hasn't been updated yet. Even though I did submit it, but... Oh well, that's a rip, but okay. Um... Hmm. The thing is, this is such a precarious game, and any misplay on either of our ends, or, like, bad prediction, could easily change the... Oh, Oh, I forgot that was a thing. Oh no. I forgot.
Uh, and this is what I mean. This is what I mean. This is exactly. This is literally like just exactly what I mean by, like, uh, son of a bishop. I know, I know, but still. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna click heavy slam because it's fun. I like clicking buttons. It's fun. Clicking buttons is most fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, I click protect. Hmm, <laughs> 56. I mean, 60. It's heckin' 56, yeah. Ooh, that means that they're... Ooh, they must be minus special... Uh, minus defense. Uh... Yeah. Oh well. I mean, like, okay, setting up in front of Stila would have been been great. But, like, the, the second call mine, that was just a huge misplay. Like, bruh. This thing isn't banned, and that's what scares me the most about this thing. Um, Jack, maybe, could tank some hits. What is it? Delip- Oh, my god. Bruh. Bruh. Um. Probably just go into the, the child. Hush now, child. Wow, okay, I'm just getting chip- I'm okay with that. I like the chip. Chip is fun. Chip is fun. They're carrying Shadow Ball on that thing. Um, if I go for a Shadow Ball here... Okay, see, that's the thing. Versus, um... Heckin' uh... Emvor. It's not Choice Band, but who cares? Shadow Ball does that much, but it's not, let's say it's 252 Psychic K is it, Shadow Ball does that much, it's at that much, so that's not great. I'd prefer to keep this thing healthy. I'll keep this thing healthy. Make a choice, and this is my choice. I wall this thing with, like, with Stila, so I'm not too worried about Aegislash. They are really pressed tight. Like, as it's going, I'm chipping down their team pretty rapidly, and they are not chipping down my team. Why does it say that friend Chonk- I did- What? I don't understand. Um. Oh, right, it got hit by a skull. Yeah, I'm gonna- I'm just making a safe play here, because this cycle that we're in, it's benefiting me, and, um, yeah, I don't heckin' know. Okay. Okay, so I could just go for Shadow Ball here. But the thing is, they're probably going to predict that, and they're going to be like, now I've conditioned them to think that I'm going to uh, substitute. So instead, I'm going to use Shadow Ball. I'm going to use Shadow Ball so that they Shadow Ball me, and then... They think I'm about to use substitute, but instead I KO their Latios. Their Latios. So I'm not gonna let them do that. Like Nafam. Okay. Well, I don't want. I don't. I'm not willing to be conditioned because this is, like, okay. Flamethrower here. Tardy three. Um, if they go for a King Shield or anything, really, it doesn't matter. Um. Uh, what do I do here? What happened last time? Because that could give a bit of a hint. Landorus, no. Okay. Shadow Ball, Flamethrower, faded. And then they went for King Shield right here. 
but let's say they instead go for Shadow Ball, then I would want to protect and just get free, chip, free heal. So either way, it's good to protect. Because I protect, and then they go for protect, and then I get to go for flamethrower. Or, or basically leech seed, actually. Or I go for protect, and then they hit me, and then I get a tiny bit of recovery. With my lefties. Yeah, it's, it's a very good thing that I'm bringing protect. I wish the protect had more PP. I have a feeling I'm going to run out, and it's going to like really damage my game plan because of it. Now, so if they're a smart player, they might want to switch to Embo right here, and that'd be a good play. No, I'm just going to Leech Seed. Heck it. Heckin'. No, nah, just go for Leech Seed. If they hit me, now all of a sudden I'm healing just so much. No. Nah, fam. I've got this game in the bag. I don't know why they didn't bring back a low bunny. It's just so strong. I mean, I didn't actually over-prepare for it, which is good. Unlike with, um... I don't remember what, but, yeah. Basically, I can't let them get Celesteel at a low health, so I'm not going to let them- There we go! See, I called this. I literally called this play. Um, I called their play, and I'm getting good because of it. So now I will protect to get the extra chip and the extra heal, and now Scald... They're carrying Scald. Seriously? Bruh. Okay. Seems weird that they're carrying Scald. Unless they're doing that on purpose to bait me. And if they do, well played to them. Like, that is, like, oh my god. If they're carrying Thunderbolt or Thunder, and they go for Scald here so that they condition me, so that I'm thinking, oh, they're not carrying Thunderbolt or whatever, that is, like, big brain plays there, and, like, oh my god. That'd be hype if they managed to do that. Oh. Because they know that I protect, so they know that I'm going to scout out and get free chip. Basically, this is... I get a ton of... A bunch of... Chunk of damage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so Steel basically walls their whole team. Um, if they're worried about Steel, I don't know why they didn't take... Okay, either they're bluffing here, and then well played to them, but if they're worried about Stila and they bring Dragalge, but then they don't bring Thunder or Thunderbolt, like, what are they doing? Like, honestly, what on earth are they doing? Like, it's a bit of a mess, although an organized and focused mess. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm not staying in against Embor. Ever. Never. Never, ever. Because eventually, in this circle of death, I get chip. I get chip on this Embor. Mmm, juicy chip. <sighs> yeah, I got some damage. I'll get that damage. Come on, gamers, let's get this damage. And that's right. Yeah, I'll click Leech Seed. I'll click it again. And again. And again! I'm totally gonna run out of... Ugh. Okay, Jellison isn't doesn't actually wall my whole team. I'm mean, like basically look at this damage on their team, and then look at this damage on my team. There's this just 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 a little bit of a difference, just maybe. Hmm, interesting. Strength sap, very nice. Now I will switch to something because I would want a revenge kill. I want to kill. They don't have anything to hit me, so I will switch to Latios. I will take the free switch here. And then I will click Shadow Ball. And deal a huge, and basically kill something. I get a free kill or a free over half health of damage. So this seems good to me. Yeah, so basically... I'm winning this battle so far. I don't know how they can win this. Basically, the only way they can win this is if they get Steela out of the way, and then they sweep with Lucha. <laughs> That's basically their only win con right now. Because right now they're in like a circle of death. Or they stall out my Protects and my Leech Seeds on my 
Celestila, but considering how much damage I've dealt all around with Sela, like, without even having to, like, use, like, uh. <laughs> oof! That is a mega oof! That is an omega super oof, oof of doom. Okay. Let's see. How Let's do some damage calcs. Okay. Age slash. Um, whatever. Heck and shield. Blank set. Shadow Bolt is that much, but it's 252. Shadow Bolt 53 to whatever. Shadow Bolt did not do 53 to whatever. So that means they're more than 252 HP. Or they could be like this. And then max special defense. 49 to... No, they're not. They're max 252. Yeah, they're max max. It seems to be that they are max max. What? I don't understand. Oh, well. Okay, it seems to be that they're max max, so it's good to know. Because then how much does Shadow Ball? <laughs> uh, okay, well, looks like it's GG. They're going for King Shield. Nice. Nice, nice. Oh, they're getting a recovery. Eh, recovery's nice. Rather nice. I guess for all they know. No, I'm not. They know that I'm not Specs. Uh, no, they also know that I'm Life Orb. <laughs> Lol. Okay. Now they're gonna hit me with Shadow Ball. What? Hecking damage calcs! I hate damage calcs! Oh my god. They're probably carrying Shadow Sneak on this thing. I would think. But I also don't... Ugh. Frick! Well, I need this thing alive, so I guess I'm leaving it alive. Oh yeah, I, I will survive. Oh yeah, I will not die to a stupid little sword. Okay, basically, I need this roost. I need to roost at some point. Um, this sucks. Although, I mean, like, I still am winning currently. And I'm, like, in this position, I'm winning. It's still winnable for them. Like, it's totally still winnable. So, that's good for them, at least. And flamethrower. Hit you with some damage now. No, I'm gonna leech seed. Nope, nope. Gonna leech seed here. Because they're gonna switch. Yep. Here we go. Now I sack something, or not really what you would call sack. I'm gonna go to Dawn Fan probably here. Seems good. Because, uh, that sucks. Um, what is this? Emble. Wallbreaker. But it's not carrying band. No, no band. Okay. Then Cinderachi. Whatever it's still that much. And then I KO with... Seems good. Or... Dawn Fan. It does that much. And I Horsepower does that much. And I can get a Stealth Rock up. Should be able to get free Stealth Rocks, so I'm gonna do that. Because it's gonna totally nerf this boy. This guy needs a nerf. My guy, you need to be nerfed. Yeah, and I'm lefties, and... Pff, the Leech Seed. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I'm gonna get my Rocks. Because... I'm gonna, I'm gonna neuter this boar. This boar needs to get out of here. Oh my god. What? 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 Hmm. 
My head is spinning right now. I'm thinking like, what the hell? How is that even possible? I don't need this boy for anything else, I don't think. So I'm just gonna ice shard to get a bit of chip. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I get, yeah, okay. Whew. I'm not gonna go into Jack yet, just to be safe. Um, Jack and Pumpkin. Jack is a little boy pumpkin. His U-turns only do that much damage, which is just barely enough to kill this boy. So now I'm going to tell Adia so that I can get some health back. Please, don't crit me. I beg of you. If you do, I will truly be very sad. So don't. Just don't. Don't crit me. Don't. Don't do it. Don't. I'm, I'm just telling you, just don't crit me. Huh. <sighs> Funny bird, 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 oh no, not the funny bird. This is my arch nemesis, Mr. Funny Bird. Funky monkey bird. Psychic, dang. <laughs> that would've been cool. I was hoping that they were gonna go for swords dance. But they didn't. It makes me sad. Quite sad. Now I don't have my, they have their funny bird, but I don't have my even more funny looking bird. Their funny bird? It's funny bird. But my bird? It's funny because it looks weird. It doesn't look like a bird, but it's still a bird. <sighs> oh well. I... I'm... <sighs> Dang it. Didn't I just say to myself, Now you sunny there, don't you dare go for things like that there. Don't make risky plays. For indeed, one big misplay can end the game for you. And then what do I do? I make a big misplay and go straight ahead because this name, Funny Go Bird Go Burr, it's funny. It's a funny bird and it makes me want to just click buttons because it's fun. Just like the funny bird, it's also fun. And it's funny that it goes burr. Because indeed when a bird flaps its wings, it doesn't go burr. Maybe that's why it's funny. Because it's just a bird. But instead of flapping its wing, it goes <laughs> Or whatever. Sorry if that sounds bad in the mic. <laughs> oh dear. Anywho. Now they have to make their move. Hehe. <laughs> I should have gone to Zila. <sighs> yeah, this funny bird go burr. I'm freaking freezing over here. I'm freezing. Boah. Boah. How much does this... Bah. Do to this? No, not that. Not that boy. That's the wrong boy. That's the wrong boy. Dragality. Heavy slam is that much? There, that much. Sure. Why not? Let's do it. Come on, gamers. Let's get this dragalgy out of the field and take them down one by one. One by one, they will all perish. Ooh, ooh. Then perish. Ooh, ooh. If they go into Jellicent, good play on them. If they don't, well, thank you for your Dragalgy. I will gladly take this. Boy. I don't know why they're not carrying Thunderbolt or Thunder. Like, huh. That's just bad play on them. Oh, I forgot about Beast Boost. Oh, that's hype. That is hype. Oh, that's so hype. Ooh. Uh. Yeah, okay, it's definitely probably GG. Um. So now I win by staying in with Stila with my 500 defense. And basically... Whoa, I want to see this. Steela got the kill on Sandman. No! No! They were almost 6 0 by Steela! I'm so sad! Oh, this is a very sad day. This is the saddest day. 
Oh. Dang it, M4. Uh, I am jelly. Jelly of that boy. Damn, boy. That's a boy. Look at that boy. Oh, no. I know what's about to go down. Da na 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 Star Wars! Yep, this is what's about to go down. Tiny bit of chip. <laughs> ah! Oh my god! <laughs> the one time I use the flamethrower, I get the bird with a 10% chance. And then when they use uh, Scald like seven times. <laughs> ah, this is hilarious. Oh man. Okay, but what I was getting to before, it's so sad. Uh, Stila only doesn't get six kills. Dang it. Because Heckin' Embor. Heckin' Embor killed himself. Now don't do that, kids. Don't commit suicide. It's bad. It's very bad. This is the worst thing that you could ever happen. This is very awful. Yeah. Yep. 39%. Okay, I'm getting there. We're getting there. Come on, gamers. We're getting there. We're draining this de jelly down to nothing. It's over. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Zero out of nine times? Oh, this is a lull moment. This is a moment of many lives. I will protect here. I uh, Steela just got five kills. Steela five O's. Damn, that's totally what I'm Oh. Steal a sweep! You could even call this a sweep. Six five O. Oh my god, I hate I hate him, Bor. I hate him. It's awful person. Awful human being. Why would they do this? Oh, I'm stupid. I could have... Uh, I could have KO'd it and gotten plus one defense, but I'm stupid and decided not to. For whatever reason. They're gonna go for King Shield. I'm gonna go for a flamethrower. Wow, we're in a really heated battle. This flamethrowers, they're being thrown left and right, and here we go, another one. Oh my god. Oh my god, Dr. Doofy's hurling flamethrowers over and over again. He looks like he even got a gun. Oh, it's a flamethrower gun. And he's flinging them, and again, and again, and again, oh my god, this is insane. We've never seen such gameplay like this. And the funny go go burr is all that stands between him and victory. What will become of our hero? Or maybe our villain. Dr. Doof is a villain, after all. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Slurpuff, because they didn't bring... Uh, low pony, basically Slurpuff is useless. So, that's fine. Yeah, Ladios has actually been pretty good. <laughs> oh my god. Why, wait, why not go for Shadow Ball? This is their only ch- Oh my god. Yeah, well, now they're trying to stall me with time or something? Come on! Get with it. Okay, with two defense, I should be good. I should be good. Oh no, don't you freaking dare. Do not, don't you dare. 
Don't you dare. And on that note, Halucha on Burden Sweeper. Heavy Slammed is that much, they're on that much. Don't you freaking dare crit me. I swear. No crit. Nice. Nice. <laughs> no crit, please, Lucha. How about not? No crit. No Lucha crit. No, no. That's a big no, no. Uh oh, that's a big no, no. Oh, GG! GG! Oh, what? Dang it. No crit. Don't do the crit. Don't do this. Don't, no, no, not crit for you. No, how about not? <laughs> yeah, okay, great. This was an awesome battle. <laughs> so Steel, I got five out of six kills. Five out of six kills. This this is this is as close to a steel asleep as you get, and this was I didn't have to bring in Cinderace once, and Venusaur Mega like only came in once to tank a Scald and then just click Leechy to then go back out, and then Slurpuff only click Protect. Basically, Celesteela did all the work with Latios coming in to tank hits and deal little chip, and then Donphan to get the rocks up and do little chip and all that. Oh. But Sila, Sila is the MVP of this battle. This was amazing. Oh, I'm so hyped. Oh, this is so cool. Well, uh, I'm going to be back for week, um, yeah, week six. And I don't actually know who my opponent is. I should probably start team building. Yeah, because otherwise I'm going to get too far behind. Oh, Sila totally just walled them. I don't understand why they didn't bring Thunderbolt or Thunder on Dragalge. Why? <laughs> uh, they, they were not really, they didn't really have themselves together. But I think eh, they had themselves together enough to form a cohesive team that I actually had to battle against, except for Sila just basically came in and, no, oh, no, I kill you, kind of a thing. Anywho, uh, GG to Word, and uh, yeah. I will see you all in the next video.